we were meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality. Hello, hello, Pisces. Thank you for being here. Uh, All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it, Pisces. Um, Thank you, God, for blessing Pisces with with a clear, concise message from you. When I was kind of like... um, meditating off camera for you I got one who sees okay so one who sees I don't know you know a seer uh, psychic um, soothsayer I don't know you know one who sees let's see what's going on here the two of swords the magician so maybe you can't see the future or you're channeling or you have been channeling or you need to something about leaving something alone coming back to it and making a decision on it once you get some knowledge from the universe once you channel once you get knowledge of maybe in regards to a home or a group of women or um solidifying something three of swords you could be going to um someone who is intuitive ace of pentacles so it's like maybe they're giving you um knowledge about when to make a move or, or to separate or to stay away from uh, ace of pentacles a uh, page of cups maybe they're going to give you good news about business matters um psychic abilities also clairvoyance developing your psychic abilities this could be what you're doing and what you need to do okay with the page of cups here in the ace of pentacles self uh actualization actually you know developing your psychic abilities um you could be going to a class or a group of people who actually help you with this help you unlock or unblock help you see two of swords three of swords something about blockage or interference or uh, something reversal going backwards yeah, um, you could be looking at astrology. You could be an astrologer. Yeah, the with the will of fortune in the chariot. Something about you moving forward or making a move or where your life should be going, the trajectory of your life. So you're going to a seer, one who sees, or an astrologer, or somebody who can help you um, map out your life in terms of maybe your astrological sign, your zodiac makeup um, here. Uh, what you should be doing right now. You could be doing this in regards to another person trying to figure out where they're going to be or maybe you're trying to get in alignment with their chart, their birth chart. Ten of Wands could be with a Sagittarius or this is what someone's doing in regards to you. Taking somebody for granted, scapegoat, uh, drudgery, heavy load, burden. Every day is a struggle. Um, You know, cracking under the weight of your own success something's ending or a relationship ended somebody let go or they're releasing or it's becoming too heavy somebody's been on autopilot in regards to a connection um not knowing where it's going just showing up for it blinded or blindly the blind leading the blind or maybe you're going to that's why you're going to one who sees or a uh, blinded by love or devotion 
not knowing where the relationship was going. This could be toxic, toxic or karmic now. What's going on here? Could be with a masculine energy, maybe making a move or having to move or yeah. Um, all of a sudden out of the blue, having to move or um, your fortune changing all of a sudden, four of cups, feeling like you missed out or uh, being self-centered, maybe focusing everything on self, not seeing, you know, why this is happening, not really seeing the reason why. Um, too self-centered. If I would have done more, if I would have given more, if I would have stayed less or given more. But there's a reason. Go deeper. That's what the cards are saying. This is also maybe a will of fortune change in something about being out or kicking somebody out or co closing the door or separating or being kicked out. Lack... Lack of communication, misinterpretation, misrepresentation of what it is you're saying or what you want or what is not being said. Um, trying to read somebody's mind, trying to intuit uh, what someone really wants or developing your clairvoyance or going to um, somebody who sees someone who is clairvoyant and asking them about your future or them helping you kind of pinpoint where you should be. What's the advice here for Pisces? Pisces, it looks like you're trying to get to a particular place or a particular outcome. You want a result here and you're trying to go somewhere or get some knowledge of how to get that particular outcome. You're unsure about reconciliation or coming back together or dealing with a particular person. Let's see what's going on here for Pisces. What's the uh, outcome here for Pisces? Oh, the temperance in reverse. So you're dealing with the Sagittarius or a relationship not coming back together. There's no compromise. There's no seeing no eye to eye. We're not on the same wavelength. There's no yin. There's no yang. Um, there's no change therefore we can't um, make it work yeah five of swords something going backwards I talk I said that maybe interference heavy interference maybe from a Taurus I don't know it could be for anybody but there's heavy interference where everything reverses it goes backwards maybe somebody goes back to their childish ways or back to doing whatever it is they're doing or close down emotionally um, I heard triggers also um, heavy argument that that somebody doesn't govern their tongue they say anything the queen of cups uh, is the outcome yeah, somebody goes into a place of trying to maintain their emotional stability because this is destabilizing somebody here this energy and it's not um, it's not harmonious it's not long term. It's not a wealthy, healthy marriage or relationship. Yeah. It's, it's filled with a lot of fantasy, a lot of wishful thinking, a lot of promises that just are broken, were made to be broken. This is what I have for you, Pisces. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website and book your reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also buy me a coffee if you're feeling moved to do so the link is below buy ella coffee and if you're a business-minded individual go ahead and sign up for the km the ktmt uh waitlist monthly conference call waitlist you're going to be uh, surrounded by like-minded individuals like yourself who are starting business or furthering their business um, getting valuable information also you can book your discovery call to see if I am a best fit to help you in your business matters okay thank you many blessings to you take care